Some good news for Florida Power and Lake customers. The utility will lower the amount that it charges customers because of lower fuel costs. FPL says its 2009 fuel bill is running about 6% less than originally estimated. By law, those reductions have to be passed on to its customers. FPL credits investments in making power plants more efficient and energy efficient programs that help individual customers manage their electricity use for that savings. Customers will save another $5 a month on average starting in January of 2010 when FPL expects fuel costs to go down even further. FPL serves about 4.5 million customers in Florida and employs nearly 11,000 employees. Cash for Clunkers has been such a popular program that local car dealerships are having a hard time keeping new inventory on the lot. In response to the surge of car buyers, the government is offering a voucher program that could allow consumers to pick up cars la later that are avail unavailable now. Those cars that qualify for the government rebate program are in short supply at Germain Toyota. Staff there say they have customers who want to buy cars now that may not come in until September or October. We normally stock 300 to 350 new cars, and right now we have about 60 left. So. Big difference. Big difference, especially for the summertime. The Transportation Department announced the voucher program Thursday. Before the changes, buyers could only choose from vehicles that were on the car lot.